Hey, what's going on? Matt Morris here. Wanted to record a quick video for you guys on how to establish credibility if you are a young person in network marketing. And yes, you're looking at me thinking, man, he can tell me this because he's so young, right? Listen, I know I'm not so young anymore, but I did get started in network marketing when I was 18 years old and I uh, got full time at the age of 24, built a team of 10,000 people in a two year time frame, being a young entrepreneur. In fact, I am in the house of one of my best friends here, Sasha in South Africa, just bought his dream home at 20 four years old and this place is absolutely ridiculous it used to uh, belong to the president of Mozambique I mean you just look at this place it's uh, I don't have time to go through and uh, show you everything but uh, crazy crazy nice I mean at 24 years old to have a dream mansion like this pretty ridiculous and so you know when I have young people whining to me and complaining saying you know I don't have any credibility uh, look, listen, Sashin, he didn't have any credibility either. He struggled in a big way. He got started at 18, very, very young guy in South Africa where the average income is uh, uh, somewhere around 300 US dollars per month. And so, uh, you know, he went through a lot of rejection, going through his bedroom now, double bed there. Um, absolutely ridiculous. You should just see his uh, collection here. So, uh, anyway, we're, uh, looks like we're out here cleaning. How are you? So listen, here's, uh, here's the thing on credibility. Number one, realize that your uh, belief about you not having credibility is way more in your mind than it is in other people's minds. And the reality is, if you are showing up like a kid, people are going to treat you like a kid. You know, it's like... Uh, Kids are always saying to their parents, teenagers are saying to their parents, you know, you, you treat me like a kid, you treat me like a kid. Well, stop acting like a kid. So if you're showing up and you got your hair whacked out, if you got face piercings everywhere, if you're, you know, not dressed sharp, then listen, first impressions mean a lot. So when I was young, what I started doing was I started looking the part. I started dressing sharp. And I realized that the credibility is in my mind. See, I used it as an excuse for a lot of years and I finally realized it's all in my mind because I had a mentor set me straight. And uh, we got an Aston Martin out here, his Ferrari out here. So um, listen, no excuses if you're young. So here's the reality is when you can show up and you're amazingly well read and you've read more books on communication skills than the person that you're presenting to who's 30, 40, 50 years old, you're gonna show up as being impressive. You've read more books on leadership, more books on network marketing, more books on sales. And see, that's what I did. I decided to become an expert in the areas that I needed to become an expert in. And so, uh, you know, you read five books on one subject, that's more than what 99% of everyone in network marketing will ever do. See, I was willing to put in the work. I was willing to go read five books on network marketing. Check out this pool. Crazy view. Amazing. So I'd read five books on network marketing and I knew more than everyone else. I read five books on leadership and I knew more than everyone else. I read five books on sales. I read, I knew more than everyone else. And so go out and become an expert. Be well read. When you show up and you're mentally sharp, what happens is you become way more impressive than someone who's 35 and 40 years old who's sharp. Okay? You're expected to be sharp. If you're in business and you're 40 years old, you're expected to be sharp. It's nothing, no one's been like, oh my God, they're so sharp. Well, no, there's a lot of 40 year olds who are. But if you're 18, if you're 21 and you're that well read, you're gonna show up as amazingly impressive and guess what? You're gonna have an advantage over anyone else who's older. See, I realized it was a huge advantage to me that I was 24 and impressive. People wanted to work with me. And so you gotta develop that confidence. The way you develop the confidence is number one, you do the work, you read the books and you go out and do the work. The more you do the work, you develop little wins. The more wins you have, the more confidence that you have. So stop using lack of credibility as an excuse. It is only an excuse. You can have excuses or results, you can't have both. I want you to win big, eliminate that excuse 
from your mind from this point forward go do the work win big come back and tell me your success story appreciate you guys tuning in if you feel like this can add some value to some others definitely share it love to hear your comments below and as always you can hop over to mattmorris.com subscribe to my newsletter you'll get these free videos delivered to your inbox every single week thanks so much go make life an adventure